the rope. The night fell heavy on the heights of the mountains and the man could not see anything. There was zero visibility, the moon and the stars were covered by the clouds. When he was just a few feet below the top of the mountain, he slipped and fell into the air, falling at great speed. He could see only black spots as he went down, and feel the terrible sensation of being sucked in by gravity. He kept falling, and in those moments of great fear, all the good and bad episodes of his life came to his mind. He was thinking now about how close death was getting, when all of a sudden he felt the rope tied to his waist pull him very hard. His body was hanging in the air. Only the rope was holding him. In that moment of stillness he had no choice other than to scream, Help me God. All of a sudden, a deep voice coming from the sky answered, What do you want me to do? Save me God. Do you really think I can save you? Of course, I believe you can. Then cut the rope tied to your waist. There was a moment of silence. The moment passed and the man decided to hold on to the rope with all his strength. The rescue team says that the next day, the climber was found dead and frozen, his body hanging from a rope and his hands holding it tight. He was only one foot away from the ground. How attached are we to our ropes? Will we let them go? Don't ever doubt God. We should have enough faith to cut the rope, if that is what God tells us to do, even when it seems to be the most foolish thing to do.